Hello everyone. Today, we're diving into something that can significantly improve your monitor experience, DDC slash CI. It sounds technical, but it's actually quite simple. DDC slash CI allows your computer to communicate directly with your monitor. This means you can control your monitor settings using software instead of fiddling with those sometimes clunky buttons on the monitor itself. Let's explore how to enable and use this feature. First, what exactly is DDC slash CI? It stands for Display Data Channel slash Command Interface. Think of it as a two-way street for information between your computer and your display. It lets your computer read information about the monitor, like its model number and supported resolutions. More importantly, it lets software control settings like brightness, contrast, color temperature, and even input selection. Why should you care? Imagine adjusting your monitor's brightness without ever touching a button. Or changing color profiles depending on the task you're doing, all from your computer. This makes things much more convenient and can also lead to better color accuracy and a more comfortable viewing experience. Now, let's talk about enabling DDC slash CI. This process varies slightly depending on your monitor and operating system. However, the first step is always to check your monitor's on-screen display OSD, menu. Look for a setting related to DDC slash CI. It might be labeled DDC slash CI, display control, or something similar. Make sure it's enabled. Some monitors have it enabled by default, but it's always good to check. Next, ensure your monitor is properly connected to your computer. Use a high-quality cable like HDMI or DisplayPort. Sometimes, older or faulty cables can interfere with DDC slash CI functionality. After confirming the physical connection, check your operating system. In Windows, you typically don't need to do anything specific to enable DDC slash CI. It should work automatically once enabled in the monitor's OSD. However, you can try updating your monitor drivers for optimal compatibility. In Linux, you might need to install some software packages to enable DDC slash CI control. Check your distribution's documentation for specific instructions. Finally, let's discuss software for controlling your monitor via DDC slash CI. There are several options available. On Windows, popular choices include programs like Monitorian and Click Monitor DDC. These tools provide a simple interface for adjusting various monitor settings. For Linux, Control is a common command line tool, and there are also graphical frontends available for easier use. Once you've installed your chosen software, it should automatically detect your monitor and allow you to adjust its settings. Experiment with different programs to find one that suits your needs and workflow. With DDC slash CI enabled, you'll have a much more flexible and convenient way to manage your display. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Consider supporting the channel through Patreon or by purchasing our merchandise. Every bit helps us create more content like this. Let us know in the comments what other tech topics you'd like us to cover.